Hi there, I'm Tech. This is my channel Bootlosophy that brings you videos about boots, reviews and all things boot related. Today, I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Grant Stone Brass Boot in Earth or Waxy Commander. UPS has winged this lovely box at me. Uh, it's got Grant Stone written all over the place. So, new Grant Stone boots. Oops, wrong end. Um, the packaging in Grant Stone is quite exceptional. So, I'll open the right end to show you why I want to open the right end because the way the box is designed, if you ignore that first opening, the way the box is designed is there's a little finger hole for you to pull the inner box out. So I should, I should pull it out. And the box that Grant Stone boots come in is so beautifully designed, I mean, you know, I kind of prefer Parkhurst because it's kind to the environment, but you have to admire the packaging. The lid fits on perfectly. It slips in and out. I never tire of that. And inside, um, there's a thank you card for purchasing a pair of uh, Grantstone footwear, and it's signed. If you have any questions, give you an email. Um, usual postcard telling you about initial fit and so on. Getting used to these and getting quite a collection of these little bags. Um, spare laces, flat cotton, wax cotton. Um, usual um, bottle opener and thing. The usual Grantstone cloth, lovingly packed in its own boot bag and with foam in between so they don't scratch in transit. Quite amazing. Boot number one. Right boot. Boot number two. Left boot. Which ones did I buy? This is my, what is this? This is my third Grant Stone boot. I'm so impressed with the quality. The brass boot in Waxy Commander. I think this is made to be kicked around in. And that's quite interesting. They come with another pair of um, flat wax cotton laces. I expected them to be maybe showing their ruggedness with uh, leather, but hmm, interesting. I might swap them to leather. Um, again, let's have a look at the detail. Uh, a commando sole, Grant Stone's own commando sole, it's not a Vibram. It's an interesting profile because the lugs do show from the side, but they're not hugely obtrusive. Uh, usual, I think, would you call this a reverse Goodyear welt? And as usual, you can play the spot where the joint is because you can't see it. Lovely waxy commander. Uh, from CF uh, Stade, I believe. Charles F. Stade in England. Uh, I think these would patina rather well with the wax scuffing off. I'm going to try them on. I was actually wearing my Grant Stone diesel boots in coffee suede when these arrived. brass boot in uh, Waxy Commander from Stead's Tannery as well in England with the mock toe. Quite a roomy last this one compared to the diesel. A um, lot of room in the toe box. Feels very comfortable even with the thick Commander sole. Chunky little boot. Love it. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed that unboxing video. If you did, please click on the like button below. 
what I'm going to be doing is wearing these boots for a number of months before I bring you uh, a longer term review of these boots dealing with their style and aesthetics, their construction, the company that makes them and I'll discuss the philosophy behind that company and then I'll uh, uh, tell you the pros and cons that I've found with the boot. So if you'd like to watch that video, which will, I'll, I'll upload in a few months time once I've worn it, click on the like button and click on the subscribe button below so that you're informed when I upload these videos. I hope to see you soon.